Hey, welcome, welcome. I hope you're having a wonderful day. And uh, welcome to Triple S Galaxy. And today, I want to tell you about this. The Switch Killer. And you're going to be like, wait, hold up, hold up. There is no Switch Killer. There ain't never going to be a Switch Killer. And I'm going to be telling you like, well, well, let's talk about that. Without that being said, let's get into it. No edits, no other, no other like that. But I just want to tell you something before we really start and all that. Uh, this video is not scripted. I wanted to script it, but honestly, I just never understood or never want, like, never knew where to begin with the script and how to begin. You know, like, tell you how this service is is something pretty, pretty sick, and it's a it's a sleeping giant service. All right, and then you're gonna be like, wait, hold up, a service? And I'll be like, uh huh, mm -hmm, it is a service, right? So usually everybody knows the switch is a portable switch you take it out and you just go with you right and then you can literally play anywhere but let's be honest the switch is pretty big first of all for like you know what I don't know some of you gonna be like well the switch is not big eh, you try to return to put it in a small bag well, good luck anyway um, and honestly forget about trying to charge it it needs a lot of power just to get it charged and you gotta use a specific battery with it it's not here and there and not only that the switch has a lot of flaws and a lot of games that everybody will love if the switch had them but what can you do but this switch the switch <laughs> this service right here as you can see the uh, achievement yes it is an xbox service and you're going to be like well what is that what do you mean an xbox service where are you playing on what you doing what are you talking about speak please say something okay okay relax okay the game and the service that i'm playing on is called xbox pass and some of you guys heard it and some of you guys probably never heard it and all that and here i am to come and explain to you and clarify what this really service is all about right so basically their service has a lot and a lot of amazing and maybe here and there junky stuff obviously every little thing every game has can always going to be has bad stuff right but this service can be played on your PC, on your phone, and on your Xbox. And I'm not 100% sure because I haven't really used PlayStation for a while, but it might be uh, a service where you can play PlayStation as well. So you might be able to play, play Xbox games on PlayStation. Again, I'm not 100% sure, don't quote me on that, but check for yourself and see if I'm right or wrong. But that's not even it. As you can tell, uh, right now I am playing Halo and the input and the gra graphics and all that, it's honestly really, really not bad. Like genuinely not bad. Is it, is it gonna be like a competition graphics in the competition, you know, inputs? No, obviously you were never gonna be able to compete then, you know, with the inputs like a PC inputs or a, a PS4, Xbox, etc. You know what I mean? Obviously there's gonna, always gonna be a lag depending on, on your Wi-Fi. But the thing is, Xbox slash Microsoft has put a lot of money to get the service working and to get the stuff you know moving pretty pretty smooth as you can see I'm not really trying to get away from the topic but look how fast I literally just got out of Halo and I got out and just joined in uh, Guardians of the Galaxy it was so quick I didn't need to like be overloading I need to do none of that as you can see it look at the game right now it's going to be loading and there is a game started loading as you can see right now i literally just loaded into the game press a press continued and the best thing about the service it has cross platform like if you played in the game on your xbox for example and you went to a different certain mission and you continue on your phone it continues exactly where you left off on your xbox slash pc and etc and vice versa if you play on your phone and you go to play on your pc it continues exactly where you left off on your phone it's freaking crazy and as you can see the quality honestly the quality again it's really not bad it's genuinely genuinely amazing and for a game and like for a phone and not only that i have like two bars uh, i believe that day i had two bars on my phone and i'm in an area where like the service is really not that good you know what i mean but honestly the gameplay just continued having a little bit of hd and a little bit of you know maybe i'll say it, it was it had a little bit lags here and there and to be honest i'm not gonna sit here and say glorify this you know service of xbox pass and say like it's amazing it's the best service out there but to be honest with you it really might be it depends on how you see it right 
For example, I'm paying about $14 a month and first month is literally a dollar, okay? And the rest of it, it's, you just literally play whatever you want. You get to download any freaking game you want and every other week they are downloading and uploading a lot of a lot of different games and you might think like, oh well, these games, they, if they are free, they must, be, they must be bad. Well, there's Guardians of the Galaxy. There is a lot of Assassin uh, Creed games. There's a lot of like indie games. There's a lot of like pretty pretty cool games, like really really you know sick old brand new games and all that. And honestly, the Switch, especially nowadays, it's really dying. First of all, and second of all, Nintendo really never usually listens to their fan. They just do things as they please, and they expect you to like you know just deal with it and most people really just do it i'm not really trying to sit here and you know dog on nintendo or something like that because the switch is really really something you know cool and i have the switch myself and i buy a lot of games but it's just first of all it's not that powerful to handle a lot of games and second of all if you're really buying the switch you may be going to be playing first party games with like you know like nintendo specific games or a lot of indie games personally I don't really like a lot of indie games, but a lot of people, you know, do like indie games and, you know, they, they want, they want, they want to play them. And, you know, if you want to do that, that's, that's all you. But if you want to play, like, for example, hardcore games really, really with very, very good quality and you can really take them anywhere. For example, if you're at the dentist, she just will pop your phone, get a little controller with you. And there you go. You're literally playing like Guardians of the Galaxy. The save file that you were playing on your, for example, PC or your Xbox, and quote unquote, don't quote me, maybe on PS4 as well. Uh, but I'm telling you, there's a lot, a lot of really, really, really cool things about the service. And honestly, I'm not really trying to sit here and drag the video and, and then do this and this and that and tell you really not nonsense. But I do really recommend this service a lot and i'm honestly not sponsored and i would love if they sponsor me because like this stream and the stream <laughs> this uh service is genuinely genuinely cool um it has really really good games um quality is really sick and xbox finally finally working on doing something really really good for you know for really the first time of their life i ain't gonna lie because you know they botched all the xboxes and all that but their service is genuinely genuinely good you can again as i said you can play it anywhere i do recommend it and um yeah there's a bunch of bunch of games and for the people that i promise i don't know if i really did promise at the beginning because i tried to do this multiple times again this video is not scripted but um earlier i said that i do have a game and this is a specific gaming a special game especially for people at the end and this is for you guys with that that being said i just want to say that i hope you guys really enjoy the video Please let me know if you have any questions in the comments. I will reply to most comments as possible. And yeah, I hope you have a wonderful day. And I'll see y'all later. Have a good day. One parent house. This is my Granny and Grandpa's house. Grandpa is always in his garden, and Granny takes care of the chickens. This is Granny and Grandpa Pig's house. Pepper always has a great time here. Polly Parrot imitates everything you do. Why don't you try jumping or making a sound? No! Polly's food bowl is empty! She must be pretty hungry. Why don't we go and get some food so we can fill the bowl 